drugi dzień All About Freedom Festiwalu za nami. Naszym kolejnym gościem był Mats Brugger, autor kontrowersyjnego dokumentu zatytułowanego Ambasador. To paraphrase the film shortly, it's, it's about how I purchased a diplomatic title, uh, becoming the general consul of uh, Liberia in uh, West Africa to the Central African Republic thereby gaining access to a very uh, secretive, uh, normally very closed realm. I uh, involved myself in uh, illegal diamond mining, uh, while also, you know, networking and, um, you know, exploring what's going on behind the scenes. Jak to się stało, że znalazł się pan w Afryce? I dlaczego wybrał pan um, akurat Liberię? Documentaries about Africa seen, you know, from a helicopter perspective. There are so many, you know, conventions and cliches within, you know, documentaries about Africa. Then I, th I thought it, that, you know, if, if I could succeed with this film, that it would be possible for me to revitalize the, the genre a bit, you know, by making a very a cynical and in some ways also funny film about a very extreme kind of Africa where you would get to meet all the the kingpins and players which you normally don't get to meet. To dość specyficzny film dokumentalny, w którym e, odgrywa pan rolę tego tytułowego ambasadora. I e, jak, e, jak to się stało, że pan wcielił się w, w rolę konsula e, i czy to było dla pana no, trudne doświadczenie? Well, um, role playing as such is something which comes natural to me, you know, um, and I am fairly good at dealing with prolonged periods of, of stress and, and paranoia. Um, I did, you know, study a lot about, you know, diplomatic etiquette, um, how diplomats carry themselves. I would, from time to time, when possible, go to receptions at embassies in Copenhagen in Denmark, you know, to study uh, diplomats up close. Making people believe that you are somebody who you are not, it's not that difficult really. But what is difficult is what, what comes after having crossed that threshold, you know. How does your character small talk? Uh, uh, if your character would tell a joke, what kind of joke would it be? Uh, does he smoke? If so, what kind of cigarettes? Uh, How does he dress? You know, all, all these things are very important, you know, to work on. Ambassador to film, który opowiada z jednej strony, z jednej strony o polityce, e, także o Afryce, ale w pewnym stopniu wydaje mi się, że jest to też film w ogóle o tym, że pieniądz rządzi światem. Czy, czy pana zdaniem tak rzeczywiście jest? In many ways it does, and uh, you know, especially in the Central African Republic, you know, what matters the most is, you know, who has money and, and who does not, and, uh, and who do you know of the ones who uh, have money. Co pana szczególnie zszokowało w Afryce? Czy ma pan jakieś takie wydarzenie, które zapamięta pan do końca swojego życia? Well, the overall lack of a causality principle, basically, you know, um, that anything can happen at, at any time, that you should be aware of the fact that, you know, planning for anything is almost impossible. I know that doesn't sound very scary, but it really is, you know, and, and uh, that kind of um, freaked me out. Czy ma pan już jakiś pomysł na kolejne swoje dzieło, o czym będzie opowiadać? Czy może będzie to inny kontynent, inny kraj? I am uh, working on a film about the, um, the death of the former Secretary General uh, to the United Nations, um, Dag Hammarskjöld, who was killed in a, in a plane crash in Africa in 1961. And back then, and more so even now, people were speculating if this was the result of a conspiracy to, uh, to kill him, basically. Rozmawiamy w trakcie festiwalu All About Freedom, dlatego chciałbym pana prosić o, o wyjaśnienie, jak pan rozumie pojęcie wolności. Well, I, I do like the definition of democracy uh, as defined by uh, Winston Churchill. Democracy is when there have been at least two elections and when the door rings at four o'clock in the morning, it's the milkman, you know. <laughs>